out here I just wanted to talk about graduation now I know a lot of you are graduating right now I have a few friends that are graduating from my old university and I wish you all the best of luck and I just wanted to talk about something that I went through when I was about to graduate about a year it's been a year now crazy um, before I graduated I called my parents up and I bring them up to my room both of them at the same time so they immediately knew something wasn't right and I sat them down and I said look I am not gonna be pursuing a career as a doctor. I don't wanna go to medical school. And <laughs> I remember the look on their faces was just like a mixture of just confusion, disappointment, and just like, it, it was something that I had to say. And I feel like a lot of college students are really in that same exact spot. Like I was depressed for you know, a number of years before I, I got the courage to speak my mind. And I just wanted to encourage you students that are graduating that if you feel something in your in your mind, your heart, uh, you're doing something you don't like or you want to pursue something, you have to get rid of that friction in your life. That's usually can be parents that want you to do a certain thing. You might feel like you need to impress somebody, you need to get approval to do something, but the only approval that should matter is yours. So take that into consideration as you're trying to figure out what you want to do. That's the best place you can be because you need you need to take the time. The biggest thing the biggest thing that I did was take the time to really reflect. I took the time to myself and really spent time time after and time sitting there, you know, weeks, months really thinking about you like where do you see yourself in the future? What do you see yourself doing? Are you enjoying that? Are you smiling? Are you happy? Are you growing? Um, is that you're doing that thing because you want to please someone else? You know, for me, it was my parents. Like, so I knew that I didn't want to do that. So I really had to assess myself. Like, where are my skill sets? What do I enjoy doing? What takes hard work? But I'll, I'm willing to sacrifice the time and put in the effort to get better and get improve myself. You got to look at those things. Once you do that, it's going to be a lot easier for you to just be who you are. A lot of people are struggling to be themselves. And I can tell you that as you know, one of those people because it took a lot for me to be confident in myself, be confident to even do a video like this to talk to you and uh, not have it be something that's just like will take me a lot of self-convincing to do. It's just like I'm speaking from a place of truth. Like You're going to feel so much more free once you let the people in your lives know how you feel about where you see yourself going in life and don't because sometimes we spend a lot of time thinking like oh if I do this this person's gonna feel this way it's gonna impact like it's not gonna impact their lives they might be disappointed or whatever in you that you're not taking these opportunities that they think you'd be best at but that's what they think you got to listen to yourself and what you think what you love so um, just want to congratulate all the students graduating and the number one advice I want to give to all of you is to take the time and really just vacation spend time with your closest friends spend time with family really think about not about life just like just get to know yourself just love yourself and you'll find the way